Welcome back to Star Trek Elite Force. I can't tell what they're thinking. As best I can sense, they're intent on repairing their ship and don't consider us a threat. Well, let's hope they keep thinking that. Let's save our comrades and get that stuff back. Let's do this. Come, men, don't shoot. Wow, this place is huge. Look out! What are you doing? Sir, he's coming right at us. Should I take him down? Do not shoot. So I forgot I had the eye mod. I'm like, okay, guess some phase ring. Ignore. second. Doesn't look too good. I stand corrected, Ensign. Good work. You did the right thing. We <sighs> must continue with our mission to retrieve the ice cubes. All right, let's go. I'm gonna take him out. Desperately. 
This looks safe. Did you hear something? Damn it. The last one. I'm almost out of energy. Out, slow down. Stay here and watch for more war. And someone Rowan and I will scout ahead. Sir. Aye, sir. Yum, 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 yum. I'll take that. Okay, I don't like how they're giving me... transfer point to the inner chambers. Oh, no. There's too many of them. Manson. trouble. Oh. 
I was too trigger happy before. I'm trying to. Okay. I gotta let them deal with it sometimes too. He's dead, Monroe. I'll bring his body back to see you. trigger happy before and kept using the alternate fire for the really good beam but that uses 10 oh you trapped me you trapped me This is getting rough. to get me court-martialed because they keep walking in my way. Help. Help. Energy. 
energy is looking fine, could be better. Does anyone want to hack the door? No? Okay. Let's open that will work. No. It's almost like it's a force field or something. Honestly, have no idea where to go. I'm stupid. Found it. Out of the ordinary, except an energy terminal. I hate to say it, I don't feel like being a simulator. It doesn't sound too good. I like thinking for myself. Holding, fire's holding. Alright. Everyone. Um, yeah, I was about to say, get on the elevator. What are you doing? Scavengers called them harvesters. 
They forcibly disassemble the trapped ships and take the parts and crew back to the forge. They abducted hundreds of drones and nearly one quarter of the ship before they were driven off. The harvester's resistance quotient is extremely high. A species even the Borg are afraid of? We don't plan on sticking around long enough to make their acquaintance. Seven, any information on the Isodesium? Just a moment. Query. Yes, three levels below. Quaternary Environmental Control Chamber 9 Alpha. There is more, but I cannot access it. Memory is fragment. That's good enough. Let's get moving. Seven? Seven. I am sorry. I was distracted. I would watch seven. I don't think that's good. Okay, let's move out, people. There's an explosive right there. I see it. Alright, let's go. Oh, this is a room where I'm gonna get ambushed. getting slightly tougher. It's almost like they actually consider us a threat now. Alright, everyone get here. Come on. Everybody. Here, now. That's an order. Ensign! Ensign, you... Oh, okay, now he comes. Good. There was actually a hidden energy charger up there. I saw it. Oh well, too late. We're here. Oh. The board here dismantled, whatever you want to call it. Recovered the stolen isodesium. Uh safety save. Borgen out. Thank you. Oh dear. here. Come, come. I'm full health. I almost got full energy. Come on, guys. I'm on 7 to 9. Get over here. Alright, goodbye, 7 to 9. Nice knowing you.
Can you guys handle that one board behind us? Because I'm trying to do all the front. It's just a one board attacking you. Just kill him, please. Coming back, guys. Also, I like that. That one was hidden. That was good. Alright, that should make this floor a little easier. Come back down, guys. What is that? It is the hub through which all Borg thoughts are processed and organized. I was worried about this. She's turned on us. Gerard, no! I got a feeling that the... Okay, I have an idea. So you know those... Also, I'm sorry that the music is extremely loud. I'm gonna turn it down just a bit. You know the aliens we first came across? Maybe those are the ones we're talking we about. We can't trust a board. They've double-crossed us before. That may be so, but the Icodesium is beyond the area of infestation. We would have had to go through it anyway. Still, I don't think this is a good idea. I don't trust Borg. That's enough, Gerard. Don't worry, Juliet. I got it covered. All right. Excuse me. Yep. All right, so we're working with the Borg, which is really weird because they are... How are we going to take them out with these yeah. weapons? Species 8472 can regenerate pretty fast. Since our last encounter with Species 8472, I have modified our weapon designs to be effective against them. Yeah, so it is going to be them, isn't it? Oh god, that's not what I thought. Oh, that Borg is ruined. Oh, oh he's ripped in half. Good. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'm gonna use my phaser as much as possible because I actually quite like you. <laughs> it feels quite strong when you use that really good beam. Can everyone stop getting in my way when I'm trying to shoot? Thank you. Oh, wait. Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, there it is. Let's do it. I can finally use this gun. What's under here that you're trying to keep for me, huh? A health terminal, which I don't need, an energy terminal, which I might as well top everything off. And the way back. Okay. These look and remind me of xenomorphs a little bit. Just not as deadly. I'm really happy I have this gun. Oh, uh, da ba dum bum bum bum. Yeah, their bodies disappear because they're regenerating. Not gonna lie, seeing the Borg like this is just brutal. Oh no, I'm gonna need more ammo crystal soon. It's just sad. Alright, I got this gun, I got that gun, and I got my grenade launcher, which I'm gonna use my grenade launcher now, because I actually really like... You know what, I think a grenade launcher in close quarters is a bad idea. I'm gonna keep using it. Okay, this is gonna end. Seven. I'm gonna wait until I get a little more ammo. I hurt myself. Okay, my mistake was fixed. I don't learn from my mistakes. Move. I keep almost shooting you guys. You can't just run in front of me. 
What was this gun again? Oh, this is the gun I've also barely used. Oh, I'm low on that energy, so I'm gonna be smart and use this gun for a bit. I'm gonna drink some water, because I'll be leaving for the gym soon. Nothing better attack me. Wait, one second, let me drink some water. Oh, much better. Okay. Um, let's see, what gun should I use for a bit? I'm gonna use my phaser. I'm getting a little low on ammo. That's a corridor of doom, if I have ever seen one. The grenade launcher is just so good! Isodesium. Ooh, a lot of isodesium. Gimme, gimme, gimme. You will be I knew it. Wait a minute. We negotiated. We had a deal. You will be I knew it. Why does this not surprise me? <laughs> what did he do? Oh, that clever little bugger. That's why I said don't worry about it. I didn't even see him place that, if you can see it. I'm gonna have to look back in the video and see. Oh, 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 I wasn't ready for that. Seven of nine beam directly to engineering with the isodesium. If Lieutenant Torres is correct, Voyager should have power restored within a day or two. The hazard team has proven itself to be a valuable asset. You are all off duty until further notice. Mr. Monroe, I must commend you and your team on the rescue of Lieutenant Foster. He is in sick bay and is likely to recover. Yay! You all have some holodeck time. I suggest you use it. Tuvok, is there a purpose to this Inquisition? No. Oh, that went well. I mean, other. Well, okay, so we have to worry about the Vork for a bit. They're just done. Let's see what everyone else is talking about. Out of my way! Hey. Hey, Monroe. This is great. We're finally going to get out of here. I really thought we were stuck here forever. I hear you did okay even without me. <laughs> Got lucky. He seems better. He's not as eager and angry as before. Hey, Alex. Meet me in the mess hall after you're done with the holidays, okay? Sure. All right, sure. Hey, Monroe. Nice save, Foster. Doc says he should recover okay. I never got to see any action myself, but I guess there's always a next time. Yeah. training program for the holodeck it's for testing the new personal photon torpedo launcher what here check it out i i want oh don't mind if i do
Ah. Initiating program, Kronos. Wait, what in God's name? I'm playing Doom? Interesting weapon. Oh, I'm out. some sort of Klingon homeworld. Does this damage me? I think that's gonna damage me. Yes, yes, it damages, it damages. Neutralize all 25 enemies. Oh, I take it this is the leave. Sir, I like this weapon. Congratulations. Hey, I'm in a row. I'm kind of busy. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm kind of busy here. Not yet, not yet, not yet. I want to continue looking up here. There's other places for me to look. go to the infirmary and see how the one guy is doing but they're saying he'll be fine i like how technically they give you the option if you to save him or not like you can go and try and save him or you can just leave really is everything locked and that is the mess hall i'm not going to go there yet i'm going to keep looking That's why I wanted to go to space. I wanted to go to space for that very reason. See that beautiful, beautiful purple JPEG. Ensign Alexander ah. Monroe. Oh, this Access is, granted. Oh, this is my room. I must have been on the football or soccer team. There's Earth. South America. Look at that handsome man, that's me. They should at least put a shower head there, because this is supposed to be the bathroom, right? Alright, let's go to the mess hall. Maybe I'll end it there, because gym soon. Oh. Well, hello, Ms. Murphy. What can I get for you today? Hmm. How about some Tarkalian wine? Excellent choice. Alex. Hi, Telsia. Looks like we're pretty much out of the woods now. I guess. Tuvok sounded pretty pleased. I guess he's warmed up to you some. <laughs> I don't know about that. Well, he just has to get to know you better. 
You know, a couple of times there, Commander, I really thought you might not make it. I can get you. I'm Thanks. glad you did. Thanks. No, no, this is Me great. too. What is it? Pie. Mm. Uh, what kind of pie? Pie flavor. Oh, just pie? What kind of pie? Lorinax grub roach pie. Have a nice meal. Ugh. A little more adventurous than you intended, Tom? A little? So, uh, I was wondering... So, how's the Tarkalian wine? I was told 2245 was an excellent year. Oh, uh, yes, it's good. Thanks. Well, uh, I have to go take a shower. Oh, see you later, Alex. All right, see ya. I can assist you with that. <laughs> So Bellana says the isodesium is working perfectly. That's good to hear. I'm sure I'm not the only one who feel a lot better once we're out of this death trap. I hear you. Hey, how you doing, man? Excuse me. I'm not so sure it's such a good idea to get complacent just yet, Alex. I I think you're right. I think one more thing is going to at least happen. Are you guys going to talk? Michael. Sorry, I don't have time for chit-chat. No, okay. Hey. What? Alright, I think that's all the conversation I'm gonna get yes. here. Ah, Anson. I heard you've become quite the hero. It must have been fascinating. The Ethereans, those strange scavengers, and, and those pesky Borg. If you ask me, you're in line for a promotion. Thanks, man. But not yet. Um... Alright, I think we're done. Maybe I'll go back to my room. Maybe that's when this. No. All right. We'll just. No. Do I have anywhere to go? I don't think so. Let me check all the doors one more time. Because maybe that conversation triggered something. And this is just uh, me double checking. Okay, I think we're good. Alright, I'm gonna use that turbo lift. Alright, I think everyone's sick of hearing that. Let's go! And probably get attacked immediately. Oh, I don't have anywhere to go. Oh. Hey. Good work, Ensign. Your team really pulled through. Tom. Hey, Monroe. Nice work on the Borg ship. We all owe you one. Neelix. Well, I certainly hope that Isodesium does the job. Every system on board is low on power. Including the replicators. Hey, what's that? Ah, what? it's I happening. Out there. Bree, see it? Hey, yeah, I see something moving way out there. Nah, that's debris. No, it's getting closer. Look. You're right. What do you think it is? I don't know. It looks like some kind of ship. Uh-oh, that's a bad ship. You can tell it's red. It has claws. It's a Reaper! That thing's coming right for us. Whatever it is, it doesn't look friendly. The Harvesters. All senior personnel report to the conference room. Monroe, you better come too. Does anyone have any idea what this thing is? I believe I do, Captain. The most logical presumption would be that the Forge has sent a Harvester to... disassemble Voyager. I was afraid that's what you were going to say. Combining the records Seven retrieved from the Borg ship with my own sensor scans, I would concur with Seven's appraisal. Wait a second. Didn't one of those ships tear up a Borg cube? Yes. The Harvesters appear to attach themselves to the stranded ships and use massive claws to literally tear the ships apart. The Harvester aliens, meanwhile, invade the ship and plunder equipment and crew. 
The effect is utterly devastating. Great. Thanks for the pep talk. Balana, how soon will we get the warp drive and defense systems back online? Not soon enough, Captain. The Isodecium is helping, but it's still going to take several more hours. I'm open to ideas. Anyone? I thought I saw something in the Ethereum's records about some sort of gunship that's stranded here, too. Yes, the technology is consistent with that of Species 1567. They were engaged in a long-range war in which they sent out giant automated gunships called Dreadnoughts to destroy enemy outposts. They possessed impressive firepower. Sounds like a giant cannon on autopilot. Essentially, yes. If we can board it, aim it at the Harvester. We could blow the Harvester away before it reached Voyager. Presuming we could operate it. However, my scans indicate that the ship does still have power. Life signs. None detected. I can't see any better option. Tuvok, you and Monroe put together a plan for the hazard team. But fast, we don't have much time. Balana, do what you can to get our defenses up faster. I'll do my best, Captain. Dismissed. Yes, sir. All right, so we're going to an abandoned ship. Interesting. The Dreadnought appears to be essentially a giant automated weapon of mass destruction. There are only a few identifiable areas of the ship. This front area seems to be the control section. There is a barrel section 700 meters long. 700 meters? The rear sections seem to contain the ammunition, power, and propulsion systems. Our objective will be to reach the control section and fire the weapon at the harvester ship. How do we know this thing still works? We do not. We have detected an active power source and the vessel does not seem to be significantly damaged. In fact, we believe the weapon has never been fired. However, as our sensors can barely penetrate the ship's hull, it is difficult to ascertain the weapon's condition. How long do we have before the harvesters get here? Approximately three hours and 47 minutes. That much time. We might have caught a break on this one, though. As you can see, we've found a tear in the hull. Whatever did that could... We should be able to transport directly into the ship through this breach, saving us the time of having to shuttle over. From here, it's only a short stroll to the control center here. Myself, Chang, Telsia, Chell, and Satlos will beam in and escort Tuvok to the control room. Sounds like pretty heavy escort for a derelict ship. We're not going to take any chances with this one. If all goes well, once we get Tuvok to the control room, he'll fire the weapon at the harvester, and there will still be a Voyager to come back to. Any questions? Good. Gear up and report to the transporter room. Dismissed. All right. So next time I'm going to be invading a derelict ship, which is going to be a hundred percent not derelict. I'll call it that. At least I'll know what it means. But I'm going to call it here. I think I went long enough. Um, next time we'll invade that derelict spaceship and definitely not get invaded. But until then, I'll see you next time. And goodbye. Logging off L-Car's menu system.